hello everyone today i will take an example to find minimum and maximum on resistance of mosfet as a switch so let's see it is given that we need to calculate the minimum and maximum on resistance of m1 assuming mu and cox to be 50 microampere per volt W by L is given the ratio of 10, VDH is 0.7, VDD is 3 volt, and channel length modulation is to be neglected. So uh, this is the input signal, D in 0.5 volt, which is given maximum uh, value is 0.5 and minimum you can know minus 0.5. F in uh, frequency is given 10 megahertz. This VG is given as 3 volts. Okay, capacitor value is 10 picofarad. It will track the input signal and repeat the same. So let's see. First, let us see the region of operation. Whether this works in the whether this works uh, transistor works in the saturation region or it works in the triode region. So for triode region, the condition is VDS less than VGS minus VT. Okay. So this M1 in the triode region as VG, this three volt, VG is 3 volt and it is more, more than V out, V in and V out. It is more than V in as well as V out by a value greater than that is VTH. Okay, V in is 0.5. So it is again greater than this and uh, V out is to be 0.5 again, so it is greater than both of these values. It works in a triode region. Okay, if this frequency is 10 megahertz, V out tracks V in with a negligible phase shift, we can see due to the on resistance of M1 and CH. So let us find the resistance. So we can assume in this that V out is equivalent to V in. So first R on mu and cox w by l current for this is this vdd minus vth minus sorry this is to be vn vdd minus v in minus vth okay whole square we are not mentioning here whole square as this v upon i r is equals to v upon i so one term of voltage VGD minus V in minus VTH cancels uh, the square term, so it becomes a single term VGD minus V in minus VTH. Now, substituting all the values, it is given that mu and cox is 50 microampere, then W by L ratio is 10, then VGD is 3, VGD, okay, V in is given to be 0.5. VTH we know 0.7. Okay, solving this, all the values we get 10 to the power 4 upon 9. Solving this, we get 10 by 9 kilo ohms, or we can say 1.1 kilo ohms. Okay, this is the maximum on resistance of the transistor. Now let us find the minimum on resistance by putting the Minimum value of voltage that is 1 upon 50 into 10 to the power minus 6 upon 10. 3 volt is again VD. This, uh, this voltage, uh, what you call VGS. So here basically this voltage is VGS. Okay, VGS minus VN. Okay, or you can see uh, VG minus this particular whole voltage is VGS. Okay, 3 minus 0.5 is VGS. This is the source term. Minus, minus of 0.5, this is the minimum value of the voltage as the sine wave maximum is as 0.5 and minimum as minus 0.5. Minus 0.7, solving this value again, we get 10 to the power 6 upon 1400 or we can say it as 870 ohms. This is the minimum on resistance. This is the maximum on resistance of the 
transistor. Okay, so what we conclude from all this thing is that that MOS devices operating in the deep trial region are also called as zero offset switches. Okay, to emphasize that they exhibit no DC shift between input and output voltage of the sample sampling circuit. We have already seen in this example that those devices which operate in the triode region are called zero offset switches because there is no negligible phase shift or where here it is said that they exhibit no DC shift between the input and output voltage of the sampling circuit. Thank you.